Peace. My name is Misty Moon, and I'm an integrative health coach for women. And my purpose is to help women heal physically, mentally, emotionally, and spiritually. And today, I'm going to keep it real. As you see, I'm not in front of my beautiful plants. I have a sheet up on my window because it's hot as hell here in the Bay Area. And so we're keeping all the, the rooms dark to keep it as cool as possible. And um, today, I'm going to do, I'm just going to talk about... <laughs> showing up regardless. Um, this topic has spun because I had a video that I did and I've been editing it and for some reason it would not download and it's 4.38 p.m. and I've been trying to troubleshoot this since 8 a.m. in addition to taking clients, in addition to um, social media posts, in addition to doctor's appointments, in addition to having a husband, in addition to living in the home and trying to keep it clean. And I could have easily said, fuck it, I'm not going to do a video today. But because I made a commitment of doing videos six days a week, I'm going to do a fucking video anyway. So here we go. <laughs> So I've shared with some of you that I did um, really, where my life really, really shifted was after taking Aaron Dotties. I've been seeing his name wrong all this time. I think I've been calling him Aaron Dugley. Aaron, Aaron Dottie, if you don't know who he is, he's a phenomenal entity on YouTube. Has like over, I think, I think he's probably over a billion followers. And his whole spiel is about raising your vibration and within that content. And um I saw a video of his called The Great Awakening, and he was definitely on my vibe, and I found out that he was doing a 21 day raising a vibration challenge, and um, my vibration has been set every since. And one of the challenges, so every day was a different challenge, one of the challenges was to wake up at 5 a.m., and I've spoken about this before in my other videos, and um, he had said, like, those who, like, millionaires, like, those who are super successful... None of them get up past nine o'clock. And I think even that's, you know, considered to be lazy. Most all super successful people are up at five or six, seven, maybe pushing it. And so I was like, you know what? Yeah, I, I want to take that challenge on. And so the first night that I did it, I set my alarm for five. I was so excited that I couldn't sleep. Five o'clock, uh, five o'clock, the alarm went off at five. And I got up and I screenshot my, my phone for accountability for the group because there's a Facebook group. And after that, I was like, fuck it, I'm tired. <laughs> this is too fucking hard. I'll do it tomorrow. And I attempted to go back to sleep, but something said, you know what, Misty? If you're serious about shifting your life, if you're serious about manifesting your vision, you need to get your ass out of bed because you committed to this 21-day vibrational challenge. Now, if this is a challenge and you choose not to do it, then you failed. That means you don't want it enough. So I got up. I got up. I pushed it that day. I was so tired. And uh, for the first three days, it took a while for my circadian rhythm to adjust. It's been effortless. I don't, I don't even set my alarm anymore. I'm up at 5 a.m., sometimes even on the weekends. And my point in sharing all this is that, oh, I'm not even done yet. Since then, my life has shifted tremendously. I went from not sure if I was going to become a coach today I went from not sure if I was going to become a coach again, or I knew I was. I wanted to be a coach, but I wasn't for sure how I was going to get back to the flow of being a coach after being away for two years. I wanted a two-year sabbatical because of my mental breakdown. I went from not sure to having a schedule booked with clients. Almost every other day, I'm talking to new potential clients. I'm. I have a YouTube channel. I'm posting six days a week on YouTube. My social media is fall is growing. My, I'm writing content every day. I have a blog. All these things are just, I just like shifted. I'm healthier than I've ever been before. I have tons of energy. There's balance. I feel the most connected to spirit than ever before. And all of this is because, not because I got up at 5 a.m., but because I chose to show up. I've also been doing a lot of inner child work. So with inner child work, it, it's, it's a, it's a type of shadow work where you go within. We all have inner children within us. And what has made my work with my inner, my inner work with my inner child so profound is that when I say I'm going to do something, I do it. If she wants to have a dance party Thursday at 4 o'clock, I negotiate with her like a child. Like, well, I have to do it when I get off of work. But, yeah, we'll have a dance party. 
and I'll show up and do a dance party, just like a parent. I don't have any children, so I can't relate, but I do. I am an, 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 an inner loving parent to my inner child. And when I've been showing up for her, blessings have come. I'm losing weight. I, my skin is clear. Well, I got a pimple because I did have a piece of chocolate a couple of days ago, but I'm just more vulnerable and more real and more raw than I've ever been before. The fact that I'm doing this video. Normally, I want everything to be perfect. You know, like I take the blankets off, put up the, 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 the plants. But we're in a time, day and age right now, where it's just time to just be real, right? It's just time to show up. And I'm noticing that the more that I show up in my life, again, the more blessings that are happening. And since I'm putting that energy out into the universe, it's responding. I say affirmations five, six days a week. There's a certain amount of affirmations that I say. I record them in my phone. The first thing I do when I wake up, I don't go to social media. I go straight to my affirmations. I put it on. I hear myself saying these affirmations. First, I list all the negative things that, I, that, I'm, that I'm constantly working on eradicating out of my unconscious mind. Then I say the positive. So I'm, I'm, I'm doing the mind control myself, but in a way that's empowering me. And I do it every day. So it's another way of showing up. So I figured, okay, I'm, I've been frustrated with this video. I've been trying to edit, and I don't know why it's not downloading. So this, and this is also what happens when you let go and allow spirit in your heart. Like today I did a video, or I, I posted a video about heart math. You can check that out. I posted a couple days ago, but I released it today on my on Instagram because today's a new moon in Leo. And this is a really intense, an intense new moon. And... Another example is I decided that starting on Tuesdays, I'm sending like an inspirational quote to personal messages of people on my Instagram, you know, people who I'm connected with. I don't like saying following, but people I'm connecting with on social media or on Instagram. And it was about, here, let me just read it because you might relate to this as well. This is what I posted this morning to my beloved Instagram folk. Everything you're, <laughs> everything you're stressing about will eventually fall into place. See yourself protected and guided. Be your best you can be and keep your vibe high. Do you know how many people responded like, are you psychic? Oh my God, OMG. I, that's exactly what I needed to hear. I mean, I, I, could, I have a whole list right here of people that responded in that, in that, in that light. And it's because I showed up. I said I was going to do something and I did it. And then look what happened. I can go on and on and on of so many examples of how there were times where I didn't want to show up. I was too tired. It was too moody. I still have a lot more shit to do after this video. But I'm just, I'm in now. I'm totally in. And I want to inspire you to just dig your feet into the ground. Dig your heels into the ground, as they say. And just fucking do it. Just start showing up. Just start showing up. Say you're going to do something and just do it. it. It's just really simple, but yet it, it doesn't have to be complicated. It's a simple thing. And you'll be amazed of how your life will shift for the better when you show up. Because you're letting the universe know that you're serious. So if you're struggling with weight, you're struggling with fibroids, you're struggling with depression, your house is a mess, you don't have the job that you want, you're not in the relationship you want to be in, you're unhappy... And you don't know what to do. What I'm saying is choose one thing that you know is going to serve your highest good and do it. If that means going to a meeting, reading a book, not checking your social media for the first couple of hours of the day, whatever it might be, you'll get so much, so much empowerment. And, you're, and this is a person that was so insecure. I was so insecure like just a year ago, probably even like six months ago, constantly worried about what people were thinking trying to do the right thing to look perfect. And all that did was just drain me. And um, now that I'm showing up for myself, I don't care. I don't give a fuck. And I'm so liberated as a result. And life is so much more, it's, life is so much more interesting when you just show up because you never know what's going to happen. You never know what you're going to meet. I'll say this one last thing. Because I've been showing up, I have, over the course of the last two months, have accumulated friends from all over the world. I have a friend in the UK, a friend in Singapore. I have a friend, where, where is uh, Fiona? I think, she's, I, I think she's in Australia. And it's just, <laughs> my mind is just blown. 
it, it, it's just so just show up. I just want to encourage you to show up. I can go on and on, but that's it. I'm tired and delirious, and um, I just want to be accountable because I said I would do it. So hopefully this message resonates with somebody. There's a reason why I'm, I'm, this is happening. I'm just going to trust it. So with that said, if you resonate with this message, please like and subscribe to my page to help me spread my light. That's all I'm doing here to create that ripple effect into the collective conscious that we can all ascend because we all want to ascend. You know you want to ascend. You know that you want to and you're stuck. You can't figure it out. It's really, really simple. And if you need any support whatsoever, I am a coach. I'm, my confidence is just to the roof because I'm seeing the results that I'm getting with the women I'm working with. And it's so amazing. It's so amazing. <laughs> and so if you need some support, reach out to me. I'm offering a free, free, free conversation, a free session, no time limit. As long as well, the, the session ends when you're ready. So at the very least, even if you don't sign up for my program, you can at least walk away with some tools and, and a lot more clarity, not even a little, but a lot more clarity about what's keeping you stuck. So take me up on the offer. All right? I'm sending you so much love, so much light. Get fierce. Get fierce, you guys. Get fierce. Get, get into your warrior mode. This is the time. There's a lot of crazy dark shit happening out there in the world, and the world needs us. The world needs us to be healthy, to be grounded, to be light. The world needs us to unite with the other light workers. The world needs us. So I know there's someone out there that's vibrating with what I'm saying right now. I'm just going to trust that. Misty Moon loves you. Have a wonderful evening day whenever you're watching this video. Until then, peace.